Hello, and welcome back to Oddworld Stranger's Wrath HD. In the last episode, we took on the Dandy Digger Gang and saved Eugenius. In this episode, we are going to go into the sewer and bag your mama. Hey there, stranger! Joe Mama's hiding out in the shipwreck past the sewers. But to get in the sewers, you gotta talk to the sewer worker. And man, does that boy stink! Woo! Yep, so you're noticing a little theme between these bounties is that every bounty, it's like. Go talk to blank to get into blank. It's. And. Kind of swims, okay? I don't mind it, but it's just that it adds length to the game that doesn't need to be there. Because long doesn't equal good. Now granted, I think they only do it like three times in this game. And I think we just done two of them. So... With that being said... Bullets. I don't think... Do I have bullets? Yep, I have bullets. Okay. So... This sewer is a lot more complicated than it needs to be. Those currents are too strong to swim through. You gonna switch off that damn current? Uh, Alright, I'm switching it off. Don't get your boxers all bunched up. Yep, so this is the water level of the game. And I wouldn't mind it so much if it didn't drag on past its welcome. You're gonna notice that this gets old real fast having to swim because you don't swim very fast. Ew. That's the problem, is in this level, you have to swim everywhere. Oh fuck! That that's a dog. That is a dog. Oh my god. These guys are just instant damage. And granted, thank god they disappear when they bite you, because if they didn't, oh my god, they'd kill me almost every time. Um I don't have any muscle. So I wonder. These guys are actually getting more use than in any of my other playthroughs. Oh, yeah, it works. Uh, this was a mistake. Oh god. Yeah, turns out. Um, you should just run around the dogs, don't actually try and kill them. Because you can't even bounty them, so why am I... Yeah, yeah these skunks are actually getting more use than any of my other playthroughs, which is weird. So I really do hate these guys. We should just pick up some more. Where's the ammunition in the game? Keep in mind, so I mean... Slide down there. Um, slide down there. And... Oh shit. Normally have boom bats for this, but I don't this time. Yeah, this is good for getaways. They knew about this, too. They knew that these were good for this part. And only this part, because, like, this is the only place where dogs are actually, like, around. Oh, 
said not to let anyone through these two women. Oh my god, I have been silent for more than a couple minutes. Wow, that's bad. Um, so, whoops, that was bad. I am sorry I got into the game. That's gonna happen every now and then. I'm gonna get into the game because I'm thinking too much about what I'm doing. Um, so, let's see, what can I talk about? Oh, um... I should talk about one of my favorite movies because it actually um, has nothing to do with this game, but um, I think it'd be a nice little segue into something that could lead to an episode where it's commentary. Um, so, to train your dragon, um, good movie. Um, it's weird, but How to Train Your Dragon, very good, decent movie. I liked it. Um, but it could be better. Um, like, I wish they had done more with it. Like they have all this creative leeway, and they didn't do as much as they could have. I feel. Fuck. There's more than just one guy here. Yeah, that's gonna happen a lot. I follow one guy into traps and ambushes. Let's see, is there any... It's a thud slug, not a boom bag. Boom bats. No fucking fly. No fucking sting me. Okay, so... Oh, God. The, you weren't there. You can't do that. It's not fair. It's not... It's not ethical. You can't do that. You know, I was complaining about how bull mites, you know... They make the game easy. And I was like, complaining about how I didn't have bull mites. And now that I have them, the game's getting boring again. Like it was having more fun while I was experimenting with the stunks. And we can just let that guy be because he's not gonna do anything. So yeah, I think we're coming up on the boss right now. And we're already we're only eight minutes in, so we're not even that far into an episode. But you might have to make this a um slight two parter. Huh. Okay. You boys all hear me? Good. Now get your asses to work excavating that ship. And if anyone tries to get in your way, we'll make them regret it. So, what? That probably showed up on audio a little bit. So, this is the boss fight with Joe Mama. Um. She is... Well, for one, I guess I should go into some trivia, because that's always fun to listen to. Um, Jomal is the only female outlaw, I think. There's no other female outlaw. And that's weird, because, I mean, how do they reproduce? But, uh... Beyond that... Um... There's also... Another thing about Gilmani, um, she actually uses all the same audio lines that everybody else does. But all of hers are just sped up, so like, she has a higher pitched voice, but it's the same voice as all the other ones. Same thing with, um, those guys right there. I think, actually, 
We only have two of them, so I can just do that. So yeah, um... So fuck, those guys hit, from, hit me from like a mile away. Give them credit, they have good aim. Um, so... Strutting my stuff up this hill. Look at that ass. It's the best. Hey, he's got a little, like, got a little weird ass. Oh god, here comes, I think, the Tommy Gun guys. I don't want them to come out. Out. I am outy right now. Oh yeah, there's those. Oh, well, you forgot about those. Fuck. I think there's bombs. Uh, yep. Let's see. Now that we have boom bats, we can actually handle some of these guys a lot easier. Priority. One priority. Priority. Fuck. Okay. Oh my god. Just. They're all going batshit insane. I'm almost there. So now she'll start throwing knives at you because you're getting close to her, so what you can do is shoot some puzzles over there and then um and that distracts her while you you know make your way over. And uh, please don't wake up while I'm on the line. Please don't wake up while I'm on the line. Please don't wake up. Please don't wake up. Fucking A, you woke up. Okay. Well, this works too. It's just like an episode of, um, something on ID. I don't know. That's a bagging them good. Oh man, this is only 13 minutes. This is gonna be a quick episode. Like, normally they're 20 minutes long, it's probably because it takes so long to get through the level, but I kind of cheated with s skunks. It's probably a Tommy Guy guy, and the Tommy Guy is probably still around, so... Let's just run. Because I don't want to fight. That's the trick, you jump when you get on the nose. Yeah, we're already done. Wow, that was incredibly easy. And I don't think I can start the next guy without, um, without, you know, dragging it into like a full hour because of the next guy. I heard about you and your mama. <laughs> because the next guy is fucking impossible to beat because it's pack rat, I think. No, that, no, nope, I was wrong. Meagly McGraw was not the one I was thinking about. No, no, Packrat's after Meagly. Okay, so, never mind, I'll be able to do this one too, because it's actually a quick one. The um, bounty is Meagly McGraw.
He's holed up in the storage room of the farmhouse, counting his loot. Hmm. You're gonna have to find a way into the house, then take him out. You know, it won't be easy with all the outlaws he's got holed up in the house with him. Yep, so... You know that farmer we killed like three episodes ago? Well... Hold on. I keep forgetting... ...to set myself to offline when I start recording. Okay, so... Um... So yeah, Meagly McGraw. We have to fight him. And he is in the farmer's house. Killed the farmer and all his people and whatnot. So now, um, now you gotta kill the guy that killed the farmer. Which actually, he didn't kill the farmer. I killed the farmer, so I beat him to it. Yeah, didn't think about that, did you? So, um, huh? This might lead into a half an hour, but that might, that's fine. Of two bounties done, so that's basically you're getting a two for one today. Um, hmm. let's see. <laughs> now, don't none of you idiots let no one on the farm. You hear me? Ain't that a double negative? I heard that! So... I'm gonna be doing this stealth mission style to get into that little farmhouse because I know this one I know this fight like the back of my hand. Yeah, it up. Um, do I have any chip punks actually? Because that'll make this a little bit easier. Um, I wonder if there are any. I don't know. What? This place is ours. So we'll just sneak, sneak on by this. Put a punk right there. I attracted the wrong guy. Well, now they know. Oh my god. They're all just walking in me now. Like, I feel no glory in this one. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? Come this. On, boys! Don't let me down! Don't you make me have to come out there myself! Where the bull? Oh, they're in the farmhouse. Shit. Do I have a boom bat? Nope. Of course I don't. Why would I ever have one of those greatest units to ever have? Well... Fuck. My life. Oh. Well, yeah, I can spy me on that. Oh my god, Where's... this is a dangerous place. Oh, my God. 
fuck my life, and that's where Meagly is, so I can't go there. Ah, shit. Oh wait, here they are. Oh, where? This is what gameplay is boiling down into. Them walking into me. And me just you walk know, in. Oh my god, I'm fucking starving. Um, I really want to make some taquitos actually. Probably do that after this recording. I'll make some nice taquitos and eat them. Oh my god, it's starting to get them. Fuck my life! This is not, this is not a favorable place to be. Um, uh, let's look around. Let's see if we can find any more things. Oh wait a minute! I think if I go back here, don't go since that slugs. They literally have every ammunition except for boom bats here. I think they did that specifically. Yeah. So I don't think they're actually able to leave the house. So you can actually just um pop in from window to window. It's like popping in and out for cover. Wow, that actually worked. Come on out, Migley. I knows you're up here. Migley McGraw. You ready for us, stranger? Dead or alive, your ass is coming with me. So you're gonna have to fight right, Migley McGraw on, and Tiny. Tiny. Let's take him down! Well, you have to kill Tiny before you get to Meagly, and that's not going to be fun because Tiny is a big motherfucker who doesn't care. He shrugs off damage like a motherfucker and sucks because you have to really, like, just whittle him down. You can't knock him out either. You have to kill Tiny before you even get a chance to kill him. Shotgun does a fuck ton of damage too. I don't know we're doing that much damage. So this is why you got stingy. It's a little tiny down. Now I'm gonna use boom bat. I'm not boom bat. Um, I'm gonna use well I want sting bees, so those are the only damaging ones that I have right now. I guess we'll just unload clips of zap flies until we find more things to use. Well, that actually is a fair amount of damage. Uh, 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 uh oh. Oh man, this guy is violent. This is like the greatest shotgun ever. Oh shit. I wonder if I can actually just bowl on my hand. I never tried it. I just assumed that I could it. But 
fuck. I'm not gonna be able to get close enough to do it though. Well, now I can't bowl him item. Whoops. Um, let's just run into the house. Oh, fuck my life! Oh god! Oh, god damn it! Like, the radar, like, I didn't think he'd be there. Kinda gets around really fast. Oh, God. There's my boom bats. Aha! I nope does not work on you. Um Let's juggle you for a little bit. Um shit, I have nothing to work that works on it. Oh my god. Somehow it works. I don't know how I did that. That's weird. Did it stink bomb him enough? Well. Well, well, well. We are finished with Meagly McGraw and we got the, um. And we got Yo Mama in a decent time frame. It's only 27 minutes. So. I will head back to the bounty store, turn them in, and. Um, that's where we're ending the episode off, because we have nothing else to do. And then next episode I'll start off in the general store, and then hopefully I'll have all the stuff, you know, I'll be able to show you more new cool doodads and stuff. But, yeah. Um, this, this is a really fun Let's Play. Like, it's, it's incredibly fun. Given, you know, the fact that... Wow, you took out Meagly mm. McGraw and Tiny? At the same time? Well, that's yeah. just... Well, that's impressive. Yep. So... There's another 1,000. Um, we're, we're mounting a big bunch of moolah. And there's Packrat Palooka. So... Um... I'll head back. And ooh, was that a drop frame? I don't know. Um And oh, I'm adding this on the other Okay, I guess I'm just doing this while I'm in this Check episode. Out some of the new stuff. Um let's see. Ooh, bag upgrade. Um, fuzzle spring loader. You might as well buy the health boost and stamina boost. And then that's it. Oh, brass knuckles. Um. Yeah, those actually make you punch harder. So now I can actually, um, for all of those little guys with shotguns that I normally have to hit twice. I can just slug them in the face once, and they'll go down, and that's really awesome. Um, I think that's it now. I will see you guys in the next Nothing episode, where we I take on an old enemy of mine, Packrat Palooka. See you then. Bye bye